Hello everyone, Rachel here with Rachel's Unique Crafts and welcome to Friday Night Crafting. Tonight we're going to do a, um, some patriotic crafts. So I'm going to turn you down and we're going to get started. So real slowly we're going to go down. It's Friday night. It is the weekend. I always think of that song. It's finally Friday. Okay. Now then. All right. So, I've got two little projects tonight, and they're pretty simple um, and pretty quick. I went to the Dollar Tree. Now, you can get these at Walmart, or you can get them at Dollar Tree. Um, so, they're a dollar at Dollar Tree, they're a dollar ninety-seven or a dollar ninety-six at Walmart. So, um, the first project we're going to do real quick is I painted three stars, red, white, and blue. And the first part of the summer, the Dollar Tree had um, a pack of skewers, and they're pretty tall. They're Probably, let's see, that's 24. They're probably at least 30 inches tall. So we're going to make a yard stake out of these. Now the letters I did have to get from uh, Walmart. And let's see, that's going to be USA. I went ahead and painted it just so that it would go ahead and be dry. And we could um, decorate with them. Um, because y'all know how to paint a solid color and I'm no expert at painting so um, I went ahead and did that now I will show you I'm going to take a little bit of white paint and what I will do is just go down the sides of the stars And make some little squiggly squiggly marks around and this just gives a little extra um, pop to it but the main painting of the solid color is nothing special and I'm just letting it fade out nothing special just some little squigglies to kind of brighten it. They're not the same on any of it. <clears throat> so how has everyone's week been? Are y'all ready for this holiday weekend? Hey, Suzanne. Love that idea. So cute. Thank you. I appreciate it. Um, I'm going to use white on the red and on the blue and then I'm going to use some black on the white one. I'm going to put the letters on there. We're going to put the stake on there and I do have some sealer. I picked it up. Walmart had some today. So I got some sealer and I'll spray it on it just to, you know, kind of help it last longer in the sun. Um, am I still in the picture in the frame? Um, I have stained two more of these. Look there. I messed up on that one, didn't I? But no worries. We're going to act like we meant to do it that way. Um, now, I'm going to take, let me get a paper towel. I've got two of them stained, and we're going to do something else on it. And it's a Dollar Tree project also. These are just some, um, quick, quick little crafts that you can decorate for, um, Moral Day, 
4th of July. Um, save it to Memorial Day. I will keep my um, patriotic decor up all summer, so. And y'all, I went to Dollar General the other day and they had some outdoor pillows and they were um, the oblong, the rectangle, and they were so cute. They were of the flag. So I got me a couple. That needs a little bit of movement in it to me. Okay. And it don't, this, I mean, I am no painter by no means. I just think these were cute. I need a little bit more fourth of um, patriotic decor. So, okay, all of that. So now I'm gonna take, and let's see, I'm gonna place these. Then I'm going to overlap them. Y'all, this is a quick, quick craft and a, a cheap one at that. And it's going to look cute. It's probably going to be better made than the ones you could buy. The most time that it takes is just painting, painting and letting them dry. Y'all, my husband is in there singing while he's getting clothes out of the dryer. I hear him. Good thing there's a, a big fan going so that y'all can't hear him. I feel like the S is upside down. You're probably seeing it upside down um, because of it looks backward because my phone, it won't flip. So all my letters is gonna look backwards. So how are you, Miss Peggy? But I did paint them on the right side so that I wouldn't make that mistake because that has happened to me before. Okay, that has happened. So I deliberately painted them on the right side. Thank goodness. Okay. Little piece of black still had some wet to it. This is just something quick and easy, but they are cheaper at the Dollar Tree than Walmart. The letters I had to get from Walmart, but give that a few seconds to, to set and what I've done is um, I've got two more and I stained these so that they would be dry I did a lot of the pre-work because which it didn't take long but what we're gonna do with this one is I'm going to I stained it with, um, let me show y'all, just some wood stain, Rust-Oleum wood stain. This is a walnut color. And I'm gonna put this right here. And I stained that before I even thought that I didn't have to. Now we're going to take another one. And stain it and glue it. And y'all, this is just some 
some simple ways that you can just get some quick, easy, cute, um, patriotic decor. And I just stood that up to make sure it was going to be sitting even. Okay, and that, that's going to help it hold, hold up. Got some styrofoam from the Dollar Tree. Now, my florals do not come from the Dollar Tree, so, but, um, let's set that on the side. We're multitasking tonight, y'all. We're getting two. There's my friend, Miss Robin. Um, she's posting my YouTube channel link if y'all want to subscribe to me because I put up videos over there that is not on Facebook. So I'm going to go to the top of, um, let's see, I'm going to go halfway up the red one is what I'm going to do. Let's see. Straight down through there. I'm going to make me a, a good little portion of that. And y'all, this one will be finished. How quick and easy was that? And all I did before I came live was I just painted the solid colors. And that's going to be so cute. And then this is this um, stake has got a um, point on it, so you can stick it in the ground. <sighs> yes, I am wearing my flip flops. I did. I've got my red and white shirt on, my blue jean skirt, and I've got my flip flops on. I sure do. My patriotic flip flops. If y'all didn't see that the other night. Okay, this is our USA. And it's backwards to y'all. It's not backwards to me. Um, so, there's that. So, that was the first craft. Now, we're going to finish our second one. And these I had on. Um, thank you, Miss Peggy. I appreciate it. There's my sweet mama. Um, so, this we just took two of the Dollar Tree stars and one of their uh, little pineapple little box. I guess that's what you call it. Um, before I do that, I wanted to do this. We're gonna embellish this a little bit with some twine. just to give it a little different texture, a little pizzazz. This will make it just dress it up a little bit. So y'all got two crafts tonight and they, I mean, they don't take very long. Our um, Dollar Tree sold out of the the lone steaks pretty quick. They were actually with the um, the cookout stuff. They sold out pretty quick, and I just happened to pick up. I had no plans for what I was going to do with them when I picked them up, but I picked them up because if you don't get something when you see it at Dollar Tree, it's not there the next time you go. And y'all, our little town has got about 4,500 people population. And the closest town besides our little town is 45 minutes either way. And that's just to get to the town. That's not to get to the stores. It takes about an hour to get to a, another store. So these people around here, once, if something hits the Dollar Tree, it's gone. Our Dollar Tree stays empty. So 
right, we're just putting a little jute twine on here. Then we're going to add our red and white um, flowers. I'll cut it right here. And bend it around. Oh, I'm sorry, I'm not looking up at the comments. I'll go back either tonight or tomorrow. It'll probably be tomorrow, just to be honest. Uh, me and Miss Robin was talking a while ago. We've both been up since 2.30 and 3 o'clock this morning. We be tired. Our brains wake up and start thinking that we can't shut them off, and then we're up the rest of the day. She delivered puppies, and I'll show y'all her signs that she sent me. I ordered some signs. I can't wait to make that chicken one. I still got some more signs. I got a patriotic one I got to make. I just need... Y'all look how cute. Isn't that cute? Uh, Dollar Tree. I'll have to read those comments. I can't see them. Um, it'll probably be tomorrow when I get to read them, though. I've got some. Um, I'll wash my hair, get a shower. I just need about 48 hours in a day. And that, I'd be good. I would be good. So, does anyone have any big plans for the weekend? Y'all, these come from Walmart, this greenery right here. And I just love it. It's just like a little filler for something. It's not, you know... But it just adds a different texture and it, it's just really cute. Walmart was getting some great florals in and then all of a sudden, boom, everything's gone. And they condensed down um, in our store um, way down. I mean, they were loading up, getting all these um, pretties in and all of a sudden, everything was gone. They condensed it down. So, I'm like, well, so much for that. But this is just something simple that's going to go on my back porch. Um, a little holiday decor. I mean, $2 for the, for the contain, well, $3. Two stars in the little box in between. You can't beat $3. Paint it and put you some florals in there. And you can take the florals out. And if you got um, farmhouse decor, you can change it up and put um, different flowers in there. So that just adds a little pop of color. And I may add some, um, let's see. I hadn't thought about this. But Dollar Tree had some stars too. Got some little stakes, little picks somewhere here. I might have some a little longer. Let's see here what we got. It's just little foam stars. I forgot I had these. Let me sit up just a second. And y'all, y'all can get these little skewers. 
just about anywhere. Tell you what, I don't want it quite that tall. Where's my... my little hole puncher. Just didn't want it quite that tall. There we go. Now let's see. I'm clumsy fingers tonight. Clumsy fingers. So um, I think on YouTube today, the video that came out was um, I took two cheese ball plastic um, containers and we made a table. We used a pizza pan, a big pizza pan from the Dollar General for $5. And somebody, they taught Sunday school. And so they brought, they give the Sunday school kids the Cheetos in the big, big containers. And I painted them brown. And then um, I added some of the big jute twine to it. I thought these might have a point to them. I don't think they do. But it turned out really cute. Now, it's on my YouTube channel. It's not on Facebook. There may be a link to it on there, but... It turned out really cute. sit on my back porch and then here's the sign that we made the big steak it's gonna go in my yard in my uh, flower garden so you need a hole puncher I got a um this is a little like a pick and I don't even remember where I got it but this little thing I use that for everything I do have a little um metal hole punch that I got from Hobby Lobby um, that puts little bitty tiny holes in my metal signs. You probably have one of those. Um, but this thing is a dandy for all kind of stuff. Okay, I'm gonna turn y'all up. Very cute. Hey, Peggy. Nice to see you. This is our little Dollar Tree arrangement and then this is our big old yard steak and the stars were from Dollar Tree so and they're backwards to y'all so they are um they are right but they are backwards to y'all because the phone won't flip and I just glued a, a steak to put them together so they're just Two simple little crafts that you can decorate for um, Fourth, of, uh, Fourth of July, for Labor Day, Memorial Day, Veterans Day, President's Day. I keep it up all summer, so the red, white, and blue, it just, it'll stay up all year. I mean, all summer, till, till Christmas time or fall. I'll take this down when I put out my fall, and then we'll go into Christmas. But just some cute little uh, crafts. There's my sweet LaVon. Thank you, Miss Peggy. I appreciate it. Thank y'all for hanging out with me. And, um, I love you all. And until next time, next time will be Tuesday night, unless I see you over on my, um, YouTube channel. 
um, y'all get the crafting, make something unique, make it personal because beauty is in the eyes of the beholder. And what we think is pretty, somebody else may not like, but hey, if it makes us happy. So anyway, I love my little sign. I love the little um, flower holder. Thank you, sweet LaVon. I appreciate that. Well, y'all have a wonderful weekend. Have a blessed weekend. Enjoy your Memorial Day. Um, remember the ones that um, some gave all and I all gave some. So, um, I'm a very patriotic person. And I try to thank the ones that I know that have served. Um, it's our freedom is what we have because of them. So, thank y'all. And have a wonderful and blessed Memorial Day. I love y'all. See y'all next time. Good night.